Hey guys, it's Taylor. I am also Taylor Grace Makeup individually away from this channel. And on this channel, I am Miss Friday. So yeah. And um, a couple days ago, the password for the site wasn't working, so I tried to write my About Me, but it wasn't working, so sorry I didn't get that up. That will be going up as soon as possible. Hopefully the password works now so I can upload this video. My facts are pretty random, but I'll just jump into them anyway. So my first fact is that my eyes change color, and not like from blue to green or anything like that, but they change color from dark blue to light blue. My eyes are originally dark blue, but when I'm in like sun or bright light for a long amount of time, they turn lighter blue. I'm not really sure how the lighting is right now because I have like half a curtain and then half a window, so it's weird. But yeah. They change color, and that's pretty much all for that fact. Next is, I am really like, big on fresh breath. I have to have fresh breath, and whoever I'm with like has to have fresh breath, because if you're breathing on me and you smell, you have like, bad breath, oh, I will make you go away. I hate people with like bad breath. It's not that I hate you, but like I hate your breath. It's just, uh, uh, uh. So... I carry around Altoids, Tic Tacs, gum, all that stuff to make sure that I keep fresh breath. And I usually have fresh breath. I usually carry it in my purse. I think I have it in there right now. You'll see in a second. But, yeah, so I'm really big on fresh breath. If you don't have it, you need to get it. Next um, fact is that I love music. I love all types of music. I'm not really big on like, screaming. I, I don't have anything against it. It's not my favorite kind. But I like pop and rock and R&B. Occasionally I like rap. I'm not huge on rap, but occasionally. And I know I might get some haters after I say this, but I am a huge Disney fan. And I'm sorry if you don't think that's okay, but I am a huge Disney fan. I like Disney music, too. I've met Demi Lovato and Selena Gomez. I met Selena at the mall, and then I met Demi Lovato at the Verizon store. And they're both so pretty and really talented and just they deserve to be where they're at and I hope you guys are really familiar with them because they're some of my makeup inspirations as well and I am a big fan of the Jonas Brothers I'm sorry if you don't like them and unlike a lot of Jonas Brothers fans I'm also a fan of Justin Bieber so I'm team both of them and I know there's a lot of haters to those type of people in the music industry but I'm sorry I still watch Disney Channel too but if you have a problem with that, please keep it to yourself. So, uh, yeah, I watch Disney and I hope people don't have a problem with that. I don't see why. I don't watch MTV, like, occasionally I do, but I just like Disney so much more for some reason. And I like ABC Family. Like, I like Secret Life of American Teenager. And then the Disney shows I like are, like, Selena Gomez's show. And that's probably my favorite. Next fact is that... <coughs> Sorry. When somebody says, I'm all about personality, you know what I mean? Usually when they're looking for, like, when they're attracted to somebody, they're all about personality, and then they say they don't care about looks. I am genuinely about personality, but I think looks do matter a little bit. I mean, because that's the first thing that we see is the first thing that comes to the eye is people's looks, but I'm really into personality. Like, if you are an attractive guy, but you're boring, yeah, no. I'm not. I don't like boring people. You have to be exciting. But, yeah. I'm really big on personality. Even for, like, my friends. I have to surround myself with, like, hilarious, smart people. Like, I just have to. That's just my type of person. But, yeah, I'm really into somebody who can make me laugh, even, like, my friends. Because I laugh so much with my friends. Which brings me into my next fact, is that I laugh a ton. I'm always laughing. I'm just not laughing in these videos because... Be kind of creepy if I was laughing with the camera. So, <clears throat> I laugh a ton with my friends to the point where my laugh goes silent or like, you know those honeycomb commercials where the kids' mouths go like really big because the cereals are so big? Like, I should have auditioned for that because I wouldn't have had to use like a special bag. I can make my mouth that big because of how much I laugh. It's so weird. I laugh more than I breathe, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's possible for me. And then my last fact is that I don't have a last fact because that's already five. <laughs> um, yeah, so watch out next for what's my purse. That was really weird. Anyway, so 
on to what's in my purse. I have a type of coach satchel and it's a long strap to put over like your neck or like one shoulder or whatever you want to hold it. Um, my hair is wild. That should have been another fact. My hair can never stay in place. It's horrible. Yeah, so I'll just jump into what's in here. I like this purse. It's super simple to carry around and since it's, you know, different shades of brown, it goes with mostly everything. So let's begin. First, of course, I said I love fresh breath, so I have some Altoids chewing gum, peppermint, sugar-free, of course. But, yeah, I love this stuff. I usually have Tic Tacs in here, but I think I ran out, so I just put these in there. So these were good, too. Next, I have my phone. It has a little phone pocket. Looks like this. I have, um, the screen's all dirty. The phone um, I have is the Samsung Rogue. Looks like this. I like it a lot. Out of all the phones I've ever had, I haven't had that many, but out of the phones I've had, that's probably my favorite. It works great, never had a problem with it. Next, I have my makeup bag, which I usually have my Kabuki and my Mineralize Skin Finish in it, but I had to put on a little bit before this video, and I didn't really want to, like, dig it out and then put it back in, so I just kept it out. And here's my Kabuki, just a random one. And here's my Mineralize Skin Finish, and I have light, because I'm super white, as you can tell. Really white. Hopefully that will change in summer. So, I'll just go through this really fast with you. I have my Colossal Volume Express Mascara. And I was thinking about trying the Lash Blast Mascara, the one I like the orange tube, so let me know if that's good and if I should try it. I have whatever lip gloss I am using that week, month, whatever. And as a lot of people who have watched my videos before know, I am in love with Love Nectar from MAC. This is my second tube in about, it's been a little over a month that I'm on my second tube. and. Of course, the, I don't know if you can see that, but the MAC symbol is already basically worn away. And the cap is already, like, not as black as it usually is. It's really worn out, and it's basically new, which is kind of sad. Like, even the label at the bottom, the Love Nectar wore off. Like, that's how much I use. I use it a ton. Next, I have whatever blush I'm using, which right now is well-dressed. Hopefully you can see it. And next I have my concealer, which I have the Costa Sense Camo Quad. And then I have my MAC 213 brush with my eyeshadow, whatever eyeshadow I'm using that day. And I just keep all that glitters in here because this is what I use the majority of the time. It's what I'm wearing now. It just goes with everything. It's a nice neutral color. So that is all in my makeup bag. I actually don't apply everything like this. I go to a school where I can't wear makeup, which sucks. But I wear it every chance I get. Um, I mean, when I'm, like, home relaxing and I'm not going anywhere that day, I don't wear it. But I don't really redo my face that much during the day. The only thing is I redo is my powder. I, I redo my powder a lot during the day. But um, I never really redo my mascara or blush or stuff like that. I just carry it around there just in case. Is that up there? That's all I have in here. And next in this little compartment, I have two pens and a notepad. This little, like, open-up pocket. My hair. I have my camera. This is not what I film with. I film with a different type of camera, but this is, um, like, my camera for walking around and just taking pictures with me and my friends. And under that, I have my iPod, which I have a really old iPod Touch. I got it in late 2007. It's just first generation, really old. But, and then I have Edward Cullen on the back. I am a Twilight fan. Just a little, like, portable mirror. Which I usually have in my makeup bag, but I just keep it in a separate pocket recently. So, yeah, that's all for In My Purse. I hope you enjoyed this video. And can't wait for next week's category. Once again, sorry this is up a little bit late. Hopefully I'll get it up sooner next time. Thanks for watching and see you soon.